Well, what is up, everybody? It's August 15th, 2023, and we're starting to get a little bit of rain action over here in the Sugarloaf area, Big Bear City. And uh, yeah, we got some, some, some good stormage that direction, so I just wanted to come up into Sugarloaf and see what was going on. But yeah, we're gonna be heading out towards the Baldwin area, maybe go up top there where Highway 18 starts going down just to take a look at some of the storms in the desert from up above and see how that is so anyway hope you guys enjoy hope you guys are doing well i never asked this early in in the videos and no one probably watches till the very end so if you guys like what i do it would really help me out if you if if you subscribe and hit that like button it really does have a huge impact um i hope i've earned it not just i don't just want you to do it to do it so please help me out i would appreciate it but anyway yeah so we're gonna come down here. We're on Baldwin right now. We just turned from Maple, and we're gonna take this to Highway 38 and then go through um, Baldwin, Baldwin Lake, and see what we got going on. So just hang tough, guys. I gotta make a little detour right here. I gotta pull over because I gotta make a quick phone call, but then I'll get right back to you guys. Hang on. Okay. All right, so yeah, over here to the left, pretty darn stormy. Keep in mind, guys, we are in one of the furthest parts of the town. We are in Big Bear City. This is Highway 38 right here. We're going that way, where it's really dark. And I'm hoping we capture something. It's gonna start raining again in just a second, as you'll see in a moment here. Unfortunately, on Highway or Highway 18 on the backside, there's a lot of traffic over there. Yeah, let me look at my radar real quick because this might be a bit of a, a waste, but maybe not. Maybe not. I'll show you guys some of Baldwin Lake and just so you guys can see what it's looking like right now. Okay, so even in like the last 10 minutes, this little area right next to us has weakened significantly but it it is pretty pretty rough still so that's where that's where we're headed right now to try and get in there again hope everyone's doing great i'm uh i'm doing pretty good got a doctor's appointment tomorrow it's something i've been putting off i've been having another medical issue and I, I've, I've been scared scared to death about it and tomorrow I finally have the courage to make an, an appointment and I hope it's not too late. We'll see. If someday these videos do not pop up when we have a snowstorm, then you know it was too late. I shouldn't say that, but it's, it's the truth because the only way that I'll ever stop making these videos is if I am incapacitated or not with us anymore. Yeah, they got a, a good little shower over here. But wait till you guys see how little water is in Baldwin. It's crazy. It really is crazy. It's it's almost completely dried up now. Yeah, over here. Coming back on Highway 38 over there. Or that's actually technically Highway 18, that part of it over there, but Let's see. It smells so good. Starting to get some more rain. Again, you guys, I know these can get kind of redundant. But, you know, eventually it's going to happen where something spectacular is going to happen because of my consistency doing these videos for y'all. So we'll see. Doesn't look like anything's gonna be over 18 on the backside when it just was showing that it's really thick over there. It's blue skies there. But yeah, Baldwin, look at Baldwin. We'll get some better views on Baldwin once we're back on Highway 18. We're just gonna drive through Baldwin Lake. This is one of my
my favorite parts of town, but it's, it's hard to live over here because it's kind of far from everything. Those of you who come up here and visit, I know tip, technically nothing's that far, but when, once you've lived here for a long time, like four or five miles seems like forever. And I know we could be catching some rainbows here too. That could be pretty awesome. But yeah, this is a beautiful, beautiful part of town. I enjoy it. Again, it's just super quiet. But yeah, there's there's Baldwin over here, Baldwin Lake. It's hardly any water left. Isn't that incredible how quickly that thing dries up? This was the longest I've ever seen water in Baldwin though, since I've lived here. Whoa, what's going on up here? Lake, you guys. Yeah, it's really stormy straight ahead over the mountains right there. I wish we were going that way. Unfortunately, we're not. And my gosh, I'm telling you guys, it smells so good. It's like that rain smell, petrichor, from what you guys taught me, and uh, sage. It's what it smells like. It's so relaxing, it's so serene. Oh my goodness gracious. scary it looked like there was someone in it oh my gosh that oh my gosh I'm sure it wasn't but yeah that was scary keep your eyes peeled too because we could get some lightning here and I think I'm pointing the camera in the right direction as well As I said, once we're back on Highway 18 back here, we'll get much better views of Baldwin Lake so you guys can really see how much lower it is. It's, it's almost gone. My car needed this little car wash though. Any of you who watch this channel who are like in Southern California near Big Bear, do you do auto detailing? Um, let me know if there's any mobile auto detailer because I will have you come up here. Hey, there's Baldwin. It still looks like a good amount, but I promise you guys that is so tiny compared to what it just was. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my gosh. Oh, that is wonderful. Come on, lightning. Dang, 
it's coming down. Oh, we're underneath that really heavy cell that I showed you guys on the radar right now. Let's get a tornado or something. Come on. I said we'll get much better views of Baldwin shortly. take my eyes off of this cloud right here because there's going to be some lightning coming from here I can guarantee you that I just don't know when wow that was a nice little stre stretch of some heavy rain wasn't it guys so if we turn right here, we would be about to leave Big Bear heading into the CERN Valley as it shows right there. But we are not going that way because there's nothing over here. We're gonna go back into this bad boy right here. I gotta slow down, I'm going 35 and a 30 where we're having some road work done. that cute house right there I knew somebody who lived here in a second we have to shut it off just for a moment but yeah Still holding out hope for a little th uh, hail and some lightning. The sun's popping through right there. That's gonna cause a rainbow over here somewhere. You see it pouring rain right there. See all that gray falling from the clouds right there. thing just popped came on top left there that little orange symbol that it looks like a horseshoe I don't know what it has has to do with the tire but maybe his horseshoes are tires for horses I don't know <laughs> I have no idea well since we're getting some st still good rain right here I'm not gonna shut this off we're just gonna we're just gonna roll through smart way to go because I knew about this road work over here today but 
it's where the storm is, so we gotta go. Nothing I can do about that. Turn now, anyway. Oh, there's lightning right there. Hopefully, you guys caught it. It was right there, just beyond that telephone pole. I hope you guys caught that. How far? Did that... right above us. We deserve it. We work hard for this stuff. We deserve it. Again, just keep your eyes peeled, guys. Because since it's daytime, I might miss something that you guys catch. Because I gotta watch the road. start to get some of the Baldwin views. So you can see how much the water's receded over here. I mean, it really is remarkable. Until I wish you guys could scratch and sniff the video because it smells so good. I mean, it, it's, it smells like just vacation and mountain weather. Oh, it's just so nice. we get closer to uh, where the water is you guys will be able to really tell especially those of you who come up here often I think you'll be shocked even those of you who, who were up here two weeks ago with how little water's back here now it's just amazing doing here anyway these machines are pretty awesome but I wonder what they're doing Gonna be your best views of Baldwin. Unfortunately, it's a tiny lake now. I mean, this whole thing, guys, was all lake. Look at how little there's left, how little remains.
awesome. You guys are worth it. So for those of you who don't know, we are on Highway 18. The way our highway systems up here work is, is it's kind of strange because if you stay straight on this, it's going to turn into Highway 38 and then it's going to run back into Highway 18. It's, it's just, it's weird. It's weird. I don't expect anything less out of Big Bear. <laughs> Totally blue skies over there. Completely under the blue skies. Wow, that guy's hauling some serious butt. He's hauling some serious butt. Come on, let's, let's get a lightning bolt over here. Come on. Show us what's up, please. But yeah. We got a chance for this on and off for the next probably week, week and a half. I think we have quite a warm up coming in about a week. These guys are going to be bummed on their bikes because uh, it's going to be getting really wet for them in a moment. One of you who's still here with me right now um, thanks for watching please hit the like and subscribe button help me out I would appreciate it and until next time uh, stay safe out there and hopefully we get a lot more of this because I like making these videos so I'll talk to you guys later it's August 15th 2023 peace out you guys and wish me luck with my doctor please